for this evening's virtual celebration of entrepreneurship and sustainable corporate excellence. First of all, thank you so much for joining us. It is indeed an honor to have all of you with us here today, whether you're watching from home or from your office. The ACES Awards recognizes the services and achievements of businesses, both large and small, local and international, for their outstanding contributions and their communities around the world. All of you nominees and winners are, after all, outstanding case studies that people should learn from. Yes, and through the sharing of your success stories, we hope to forge a path to new possibilities in a more interconnected world. Who knew, ladies and gentlemen, that what a global health pandemic would change so much of our lives? Everyone has had to cope with the uncertainties brought forth by COVID-19. And needless to say, the business arena was transformed forever. I would like to thank you all of you because you were the heroes. You were the ones that were crazy when other companies didn't do it. When you made the investment to really to be ahead of the others. But today, you are the leaders. And I think you leave others. We're talking about a record-breaking 420 submissions from across Asia. And this is a testament to companies and its leaders to step up and take their social responsibilities and its sustainability to the next level, particularly in these challenging times. Out of the 420 nominees representing various countries, 154 were later selected as finalists through evaluations. This year's diverse area of winners embody the future that Asian corporates should aspire to make a reality. I predict that it is these organizations, the ones that weave sustainability into the fibers of their business, who will not only flourish, but lead us into a better future. CPC Corporation from Taiwan. As a power player across Taiwan's petrochemicals industry, CPC Corporation Taiwan has intricately weaved holistic sustainability initiatives into its policies and operations with a focus on environmental stewardship and responsibility, economic viability, and community and social engagement. Although petrochemicals and sustainability are not two words that often come to mind together, CPC Corporation Taiwan attests that it is possible for similar corporations to innovate their way towards longer-term sustainability for a greener and safer future. And congratulations to CPC Corporation Taiwan! Wow. <laughs> <笑>台湾的朋友今天已经参与我们的这个颁奖典礼，真的是非常感谢你们百忙之中还可以抽空出席，谢谢你们，恭喜你们赢到这个大奖，谢谢。The Outstanding Leaders in Asia Award. This person is the acting chairman and president of CPC Corporation Taiwan. So please help me congratulate Shun Chin Li. Take a look. To those under his leadership at CPC Corporation Taiwan, Acting Chairman and President Shan Chin Li is often likened to a father figure. Commanding over 30 years of experience with the company, he has witnessed CPC's greatest and toughest moments, growing through them to offer innovative solutions, especially with regards to building a safe working environment for his employees. Lee consistently upholds the four business concepts of safety, stability, innovation, and harmony, promoting a responsible workplace culture that cares for people.
Thank you so much for watching that. And guess what? Shun Shun Lee, the acting chairman and president of CPC Corporation Taiwan, is joining us. Hi. Ah, uh, thank you, Li 先生今天那么赏面哈，为我们出席今天的这个颁奖典礼。而且台北中游，我们一定可以更上一层楼的。谢谢，我们明年可能可以再见哦。哈哈 Sustainability is all the more crucial for petrochemical industry. Due to their interrelated, complex, and adverse impact on social economic development, as well as environmental aspects, it's nice to see CPC Corporation Taiwan setting in motion a brand new wave of industry standards. We believe others should learn to emulate. I'd also like to commend Mr. Shun Chin Li, Mr. Li's standards. As the chairman and president of CPC Taiwan, it's impressive to see how he has helped build trust and harmony among CPC's clients and employees, paving the way for a stable future for the company. Congratulations and well done.